Good morning, Reefers. I'm Daniel, and I just wanted to talk to you guys today about my tank after getting rid of those anemones. Um, this is what happens when you use the Aptasia X. If you don't clean off your anemones and put enough flow in there, they do bleach out on you. Luckily, the other ones, the current was strong enough that I cleaned them off, but there was some Aptasia X on top of that other Monty, so it bleached out pretty bad. But it is alive, so that should color back up in a few weeks, and it should be fine. So it didn't kill it, it just lost all its color. And another update is this Gold Bounce. I absolutely love this mushroom, it's one of my favorite ones. I don't normally frag and keep up with corals, I kind of just sell them as I go, and bring in new stuff and then sell it out. But this is one of those mushrooms that you want to keep. I'm definitely going to put a few for sale, but I'm going to keep one as my own. Just put it in my display tank because I don't see too many bounces this color and it gets an unbelievably gold color with white bubbles and it's really cool. So I'll make sure I put some of those for sale for you guys who are interested. But it did well. I cut it with the diamond band saw, the wet saw. Luckily it was grown pretty nice so I cut through the mouth four ways, but no problems. Check out these awesome euphilias. Man, these things are stunning. I, I literally just want rows and rows of euphilias. I'm always going to have to stay stocked at the new store. So we're going to have a tank of just euphilia frags. Always filled for those people who are lovers like me. Got the torches in here. And these are some awesome fobias. I, I, I'm a fobia guy too as well. Of course, I love all coral. But a lot of people overlook fobias. You got rocks that you need to cover but you don't want to grow like an aqua that's going to shade what's underneath of it you put a fabia on that rock it's going to encrust it it's going to look great and it won't block or shadow any of the corals beneath it so they grow pretty tight but there you guys go that's my little update as always thanks for watching and happy reefing until next time If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up and share it with a friend, and thank you for being part of the Coralus community.